Hi there, I'm Luke. Welcome back to Photo Buy. And today we're in London to check out the announcement of the Leica M10 Monochrome. So really, it's very similar to the M10P. However, the insides have changed a little bit. So on the inside, we have a 40 megapixel black and white sensor. So it's not color, it's just black and white. So you can't shoot anything else. They no consideration in London. Um, so yeah, back to the camera. 40 megapixels on the inside, it is black and white, so you don't get any play in color, there's none whatsoever. And then when it comes to your ISO, that's when it's kind of improved the most. So the ISO itself, you can actually shoot at a base ISO of 160, and you can go all the way up to 100,000. And when you're shooting black and white, that's just gonna come out like grain. You're not gonna worry about noise, it's gonna be called grain, so you can get away with it a lot more. So they just grayed it out completely, so where the A, or that an a? that's an A as well. Where they would have been red, they've actually grayed them out. You've got no Leica logo on the front. We're having great, great time in London. Chose a fantastic quiet spot. Quiet corner, but not so quiet in everywhere else, which is great. Anyway, back to the camera. So they didn't really dive into the specs too much about the camera. It's very similar to the M10P series. So obviously when we get it for review, we'll go into a bit more detail. But overall, very nice. You still got the um, Leica Photos app, so you can still use that and link it up. So it's just like every other M series. Still got a touchscreen display. It's also, you know, live view as well. So you can just touch the focus, because that's the thing. Viewfinder, exactly the same as the M10. So really, it's pretty much the exact same thing. But what we'll do is we'll go to a quieter place, we'll do the review in a couple of months time, and we'll give you the full gone conclusion of what we think of the Leica M10 monochrome. So that's our little overview. My name is Luke, this is Frodo Bite, and we'll see you next time.